So, was anyone, was anyone caught for stealing? But Tease was, and as, I don't know the guy's names. Yeah. Tease the one I really know that name of. Yeah. That did most of it. And uh, I mean, he got he was caught more than once. Yeah. He, well, he knew the Japanese were getting him some other warehouse. Yeah. They had seen him get it. They'd seen guys go in there and come out with stuff yeah. out of the warehouse. And they weren't supposed to be. They weren't supposed to be there at all, either, no more than we were. Mm -hmm. So Tease found out who it was. So he, everybody was hungry, so he said, well, I must go get a little something myself. And he got, he got caught, I guess, that time, mm -hmm. once, maybe. I don't, have, I don't guess he went back again there, in that case, after he got caught. Yeah. Then I think I understand he had a, he found a pump in somebody's garden, some widow's garden, and that was bad over there. That was against the old rules, and they they beat him for that, I think. And uh, I don't what else they could have beat him for. There's there's different things going on. See, we were so busy, we never knew what everybody was doing all the time. You never knew. But you said that you saw someone being whipped. Huh? Remember that someone was tied up and whipped. Yeah. Was that well, he stole an, I think that guy stole an onion, I think. He stole an onion and had it in down in the pit cooking. Yeah. He put it down to where they had for school weather and he was cooking his set his onion down there where the charcoal was, let it be bacon. He had to run to the out to the latrine because he had he had diarrhea. Yeah. And so he was in there when they come and found that donut and nobody knew to who to admit had the donut, who had on the the, the onion, it was stolen. They knew he wasn't supposed to have it. Mm -hmm. So they finally got, they got, I don't know how they got it, how they got the guy. That might have been a different time though, they there. But anyway, they got the guy, if this was the time where he got the onion, and they took him and tied him up to a, a post inside of one of these buildings where the dividers come on, they, had a, they could tie it up, yeah. tied him up like this with his shirt off. Yeah. They give had a long piece of rope, a long piece of kind of a heavy rope, about as big as your thumb or bigger, and then you get it and you had to, you lined everybody up outside the gate and they had to go through there and and hit him, switch, doubled up as hard as they could across the back. Well, back his back was really red and burned up, it was messed messed up. You can imagine after all those guys went through, because if you didn't hit him hard enough. They said, you want to hit him hard enough, or you'll be up there next to him, you'll be getting it. So everybody had to make out like they were hitting him hard as they could, whether they did or not. Mm. So that was the one time mm. that they hit him. See, they make us punish their own people is what they were trying to do. Mm -hmm. So they, they see what they were wanting to do. Do you, re do you remember the, uh, what happened to him the second time he got caught? They beat him again, but they said you said something about what actually killed him. He, what actually, what what do you reckon actually killed um, Tease? Well, it wasn't it wasn't the beating that killed him that time. Mm -hmm. He is swollen with water, like I'm going to tell you. He was swollen up with water, just huge. And this old Dutch doctor was supposed to be a Dutch doctor. That's the way it was early in the time because. Dr. Weinstein hadn't come in yet, so uh, he took, he got a big half a dermic, a great big one, and a, and a pan, and he started drawing that water out this guy did, the Dutchman did, mm -hmm. the doctor, supposed to be a doctor. He drew out one pan full, and so it went so well, then he says, well, you go, you go, draw, go to the rest, he got, took about half of it down, looked like, so he said, where did he take the second? Well, on doing the second pan, he was about halfway through it, and the guy went into shock. See, a lot of people didn't even know it, I guess. But I found out what happened. They, the guys that was there, right where he was, told me what happened. See, they witnessed it. I didn't witness it. But the guy that witnessed it told me that they, the second time he was thrown down, he, he went to shock and died. But we, he, went, he died. We, yeah, we had to go in shock to what had to be, probably. But drawing that water out so fast. Do you remember who told you that? No, I have no idea. Just one of the prisoners. Okay. At the time, I would have known who it was, but I wouldn't have an idea who it was now. Jeez. Anyway, he died right there. And somebody come around running and says, Tease, Tease died, Tease died. That's after he got finished, was pulling that water out of him. Mm -hmm. Liquid. Liquid out of him. I wouldn't know it was water. It's a warmer water, I guess. Yeah. 
His whole cavity was full. Yeah. So, who got the blame for his death? I don't think anybody blamed anybody. Anyone blamed the Dutch doctor? No, I don't think they blamed so. No, nobody knew any different. I don't guess. But they it, thought it was normal that he's supposed to die. I guess. That only happened like a couple of days after he got See, that bad like, feeling. He pulled pulled that water out, huh? Mm -hmm. He died right on the spot, filled it out. They figured, what well, he's going to probably going to die anyhow. They, I don't know. And nobody, as far as I know, nothing, no action was ever taken. I know of. He, he's doing the best he knew how. The guy's all he knew to do. There was no other doctor there. The, the guy was going to die he, somehow if he didn't do something. Yeah. You can't live forever with that much water in you. See? You can't, you can't even breathe. Yeah. It fills you up for your diaphragm and everything, I imagine, eventually. It loads you up. But I don't know what the outcome was. I know he, he was buried. They took him up to cremate him. Yeah. Just like the rest of them. And I, I, don't, I wasn't on that detail that time. I don't, don't know. Mm. Don't you remember when they buried him? Or I can't remember anymore. There's so much going. Wow. But he died after that. Yeah. But I know he took a lot of beatings before that. He did. He really did. And he, he shared a lot of the stuff he got, the stuff he, he used to get. He wouldn't eat it all himself. No? He shared the stuff. Was he a big guy, was he? No, he's a very, very, very small guy. He's shorter than I am, if I remember. Okay. Was it, yeah. Do you remember he was in New York or something? I don't remember where he was from. Mm. I wouldn't have any idea. But everyone remembers Tease, though, don't they? Tease was his name. Yeah. Do you remember anyone else being whipped? Yeah, when, when the bird came around. Oh, the bird, okay. <laughs> he, he whipped all of us, tried to. Yeah. But up to that stage, only Tease had been whipped. Beg your pardon? Only up to that stage, Tease was the only one who had been whipped. Well, there, there was five of guys getting beat, kicked around or hit. Mm -hmm. I, I don't know. I, at the time, I can't remember anybody was getting the rope until the bird came. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But Tease... They, they used to hit them. They liked to take and hit them and all that stuff. Or take that... Sit, wouldn't the safer thing they had and hit somebody with it. Yeah. But you know how um, a lot of the Americans died during that first winter? Um, Tease would have been one of the last ones to die during that winter. Yeah. yeah. It, was, it was getting late in the, I bet it was that late in the year, I'm sure, mm -hmm. that year. Yeah. I can't remember what year he died, but it seemed like it was pretty early in the game because... Yeah, 43. That's right. That, that was a year after we got That's right. That's yeah. about right. It been in the spring, probably. Mm -hmm. There's real cold weather. I know it was cold, it was winter. Mm 